Hello everyone, this is me, Simmons 19 here, and today this is going to be a huge and rare VHS update for May 24th, 2021. I got 38 tapes in the mail today. So without further ado, let's not waste any time, and let's get started. So I got four clan shows, one cup box, and 33 tapes without covers, or without cases, rather. So yep, let's get started. This first one is in English, and... The first 38, no, 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 the first, um, the first 29 tapes are Warner tapes. Finally got another Big W clamshell in my collection. Home rental from Convenience Video Limited. This tape does not have the Warner Home Video logo at all when I checked it. It just has the warning screens, the Warner's Pictures logo, then start of the movie. Now, the next the next tapes are French tapes. Risky business. I also have the 1983 VHS of this and two copies of the 1986 VHS. This one comes in a 90s style clan shell for some reason. Now this one's a former rental from Video Phone Say. This one this tape also does not have the Warren Home Video logo at all. Finally, the next two are also packaged in 90s style clan shells. Best Friends with Burt Reynolds. Once again, video, former rental from Video Francais. And here's the last clan shell. National Opponents Vacation. This time around, this is a former rental from Video Unis. When I check the opening to this tape, this has the cheesy shield at the beginning. And here's the only cup box I got. Badlands Night A6 VHS. Another former rental. This one has still the HVAP on it, which is nice. And now, onto the huge lot of tapes without cases, starting with Superman the Movie 1981 VHS. You can tell this is the original print because of the, the, of the style of the cassette. Oh, whoops. Let me just put this back. Hold on. Alright, there we go. Blowout. Once again, this one and Superman the movie are former rentals from unknown video stores. Forgot to mention that. Alright, moving on. Private Private Benjamin. This one and the previous one have tan lids, and the next five also have tan lids. Former rental from Video Francais, again. Now, when I check the opening to this tape, right before the warning screens, it has that it has that beeping thing from the that the technical difficulty screen or whatever it's called. But I will sh I'll show you guys when I do the opening to this tape. Death Trap. This one's also from a from an unknown video store. Same thing with this next one. Time after time. Superman 3. Also a former rental from Video Francais. These next two are former rentals from unknown video stores. Oh, this one. This this one's also a former rental from an unknown video store. St. Ives. Also, this one. Forgot. 
This one's from also from an unknown video store and from Video Francais. Now this next. These next 17 tapes are former rentals from Video Francais. Last it's here. This tape does not have the Warner Home Video logo at all. Little drummer girl. Oops. This one has a tan way, which is nice. Now, despite this uses the cheesy shield labels, this still uses the big W logo at the beginning. Let me just scoot these tapes over. There we go. American Flyers. I still have yet to get the English VHS of this. Spies Like Us. I also have the, nine, the English 96 VHS of this and the 95 VHS. The right stuff. It's part A. And part B. Now this, now this one has the cheesy shield at the beginning. I mean, I don't know what year this is from, but I might I am gonna say that this is from 1986. Main event. Tan lid as well. Burglar, French 1987 VHS. Deadly friend. Forgot to mention this and the next The next four tapes and the Deadly Friend tape are recorded on Max L cassettes. The color purple. The mission. Forgot to show something for color purple. Sadly, this tape is spliced at the very beginning, but the rest of the tape still plays fine. But it, this does have some slight tape damage throughout. And as for the lace, and as for the the letter box info, it's in French this time around. All right, a man and a um, a man and a woman from Les Films Thirteen. A man and a woman twenty years later. These are both from 1986. Well, technically, these are 1987 tapes, but the films are from 1986. A, a second copy of the French Arthur II on the Rocks VHS, because why not? Empire of the Sun. The, so the end label is, for some reason, cut. This sadly does have some damage at the beginning, but the rest of the tape still plays fine. There are some, there are a couple lines throughout. But yeah. And here's the last Warner tape. Inner Space. I also have the 1988 English VHS. And as for the, this, this uses the same opening as on my English copy, which is right over here. But this time, this uses the same opening, but. For the letterbox info, it's also in French. Same thing with the color purple. Let's ignore that. Alright. Now onto the last nine tapes, which are Disney tapes. Condor Man. This one and the next... Six tapes have tan lids on them. When I check the opening to this tape, this has a rare blue warning screen at the beginning. And then the, the 1978 Walt Disney Home Entertainment Beyond Mickey logo, then start the film. I might check these tapes to see if they have the Walt Disney and you promo at the end. This one is also known as Herbie Goes Bananas. The lid's not really in the best of condition, but that's fine. Hold on. There we go. Parent Trap. Most of these tapes are full rentals from unknown video stores. The Apple Dublin Gang. Full rental from Video Francais. Night Crossings. 
Now, this time, this is a home rental from, um, um, SCR Video, I think. And, the uh, this one also has a lid problem, as you can see. Oops. There we go. When Dogs Are Stars at Disney, this is a 1983 program. You can tell because this, this has oversized reels as well. Again, four months from Video Francais. This one, I don't know what this one is in English. So I'll, I, will have, I will look at it later on. And I'll tell you guys what it is in the description if I have the chance to check. Unknown Video Store. The Goldmobile. Maxwell Cassette. But the last one is also recorded on a Maxwell cassette. Video from Say, once again. And here's the last tape for this update. Treasure Island. I also have I also have the the 1985 Betamax of this. Sticker on the top. And you can tell this is a retail copy. Yeah, yes, since there's no stickers on the cassette at all. Now this tape has a similar opening as on my 1986 French V Toast of Mary Poppins. This uses the red French warning screens, and then the star of the film. There's no Walt Disney Home Video logo at all. So, yep. But anyways, folks, that's it for this rare and huge VHS update for May 24th, 2021. If you like this video, rate, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you again soon for the next video. But until then, this is me, Simpson19, signing off.